Hello YouTube party people, my name is Chris and today we're going to talk about how you can make and use loops in Future DJ Pro. I've already loaded the track in one of the decks and we're going to talk about the first loop panel. You can start creating your loop by using the in out button. Press it once to mark the beginning of your loop and press it again to close the loop and mark the end point. If I press it even further, it will make the loop smaller and smaller. Moving lower, we find the previous and next loop buttons. These two arrows move the loop to the left or to the right. Dead center, we find the times 2 button, which doubles the size of your loop. To exit the loop, simply press the loop exit button, which also holds the reloop function if pressed a second time. If you love the loop you made, there are free save loop buttons enabling the safekeeping of up to three loops. A very awesome feature is the send loop function. If you don't like one of the samples that you have, you can easily send the loop and, ma and make it into a sample. Once sent to the sample bank, here you will be able to control the volume of the sample, the pitch, you can set an individual filter, as well as sync it, monitor it, okay, uh, I mean repeat it and monitor it. This way you'll be able to make loops your inexhaustible source of samples. Using a MIDI controller will give you a more hands-on and fun approach to controlling your loops. Make sure to check the list of all the MIDI controllers that are natively supported by Future DJ Pro. You'll find the list in the description and you can subscribe for more digital DJ videos. Have a great day and keep on mixing!